Hi YouTube viewers, welcome back to my next video on JNT Labs. In this video, we are going to see the 80 commands of Bluetooth. So, in our in my previous video, I have told you the circuit connection of Bluetooth with Arduino, and the programming part will be done. I have told you, but let us first see 80 commands before that, so that it will be very easy for you to program it. Okay, so without wasting time, let us start. So, as usual, I told you that my Bluetooth module knows only serial communication and to send the data to Bluetooth, my system doesn't know a serial communication. It knows a USB communication. So I require a USB to serial converter. Okay. USB to serial converter. This is a USB to serial converter as you can see in the picture. And this is my yes, this is my Bluetooth. So basically the clean picture I have shown here. So this is the module as you can able to see. This is the overall module which present a ground, receiver pin, transmitter pin and VCC pin. So this is the module. I have given a cross connection. Nothing but transmitter is given to a receiver, receiver is given to a transmitter of this module. Uh, you can see in picture as well as in my cam, you can see the both of it and then uh, that's it. If you want to buy it in the market, you can find it Amazon but slightly different module. It has given directly USB port, USB connection. So here it is a B type USB connection, right? So I have told you A to B cables will be providing in Arduino programming, if you have seen my videos from first, then you will be going to know what is this A type and B type for cables. Okay, this is the B type and they have given directly a, a type module. So given it and same pins are present, a, a to B and B to transmitter and receiver and your VCC and your ground. Similarly, you can find it in Flipkart also. I will be providing the links in the description, the overall modules which I have used. You can see in the links in the description and you can buy from them. So wherever you find it cheap, then you buy it from it and for programming this bluetooth module we require flash magic so that's the reason i have opened this the link is provided in the de description uh, the download link will be provided or you can have directly you can have a look of flashmagictool.com you can go there and you can install it so however i basically have installed it if you have not seen bluetooth or previous video this is the bluetooth which i am using okay so this is the bluetooth which i was using from last two videos and right now I have used these two modules. I have downloaded this software and installed it and it looks like similar in this manner. Flash magic. Okay. So I have connected the module. You can able to see the light is blinking here. The power supply has been given and receiver and transmitter are cross crossly connected. Okay. So now I want to know to which terminal I want to open, to which COM port it has been connected. So let us open my computers let us click right click on it and let us click on manage then it will open a control panel window there you can find a device manager so in device manager you need to check for ports okay you need to check for ports so here you comes the device manager and you need to check the ports to which com port it has been connected so if you got to know that com port then you must configure it to that com port. So here the com port is 7 as usual you can able to see USB to UART communication. It is the com port is 7. So com port is 7 has been selected here and then the baud rate is equal to 38400. If you want to run 80 commands then you have to select the baud rate as 38400. If you are using normally then you can use for 9600 baud rate. Okay. So let us click on OK. And the 80 commands I have not shown you till now. You can find the 80 commands in the Google. You can have a list of 80 commands. See 80 commands for Bluetooth. I will be showing 5 to 6 80 commands. Remaining things you can do it. These videos are basically for your understanding. So let me go for images. It will be very simple for us. Anyhow, when it is loading, let us have some 80 commands. First 80 command is 8. Remember friends, whenever you are using 80 commands, all should be a caps. So first 80 command is 80. So now if it tells OK, then our Bluetooth is responding properly. Think that our Bluetooth is responding properly. So basic 80 commands, let us open this pick and let us execute each of them. Basically, if you write anything wrong, then it also takes as a like character. So that's the reason when uh, if you write wrong also, just enter it again, then you enter the same command, you will be getting the correct. OK, so next 80 plus version, right? 80 plus version. See, it has given the version with a version parameter is 2, nothing but version is 2, second parameter and then it has sent me an ok, ok. Next, if I say 80 plus ORGL, nothing but original, it is, it is nothing but how it was configured, it is again it is configured in the same ma manner, it will be configured in the same manner. So ORGL, it gives me an ok, you can able to see that here it is 
present that okay okay next at plus a d d r nothing but address it gives me the address of the bluetooth okay it gives me an address the address is in some format so the format is first four digits gives me nap next two digits it gives me uap and last six digits give me lap so you can search in google about those lap a nap uap what are those things and next at command is nothing but your name it does i am sorry to tell you friends in this only name will be not be displayed everything all can be displayed but name one name it is not displayed here okay so you can see you can't see name next uh, let us see 80 plus password okay 80 plus password p s w d question mark so it gives me the default password is 1234 so that is my default password next if you ask about the uart which uart communication you are, it, it is using it tells me say now we are using f38400 as i told you and next it has been given me the stop bits are zero and next zero is about parity bits so baud rate next to stop bits next parity bits it gives me okay so anything more anything more 80 plus reset if i use then it become it tells me okay that is nothing but reset you can change the uart settings also you can change the uart by giving the name uh, giving equals to the parameters you can find in google most of the things i don't want to change the settings that's the reason i have kept like that only just i want to press 80 plus role which is there is there so it gives me okay so that's the thing it has been given so hope this 80 commands will be helpful for you if you have any doubts or regarding this 80 commands of the bluetooth then you can contact me or leave a comment below if you like this video please like it and don't forget to share it with your friends because mini projects and major projects are heart of your academics. Thank you for watching this video.